everybody and welcome to another exciting installment of Wrestling Rampage. The one amigo is back in this bitch. Uh, everyone want, wants it. Everyone's been requesting it. Another edition of Tommy's Shoot Series. Well, guess what, motherfuckers? You're going to get it. Because I got something to shoot on. Let's talk about your pissant AEW world champion. You know, uh, John Kakashka. You know, John Moxley. Probably one of the worst world champions I've ever seen in my life. Who don't carry himself as world champion. Who's not a world champion. He's, he's a, you know what he is? He's a backup world champion. That's what he is. To be honest, that's what he is. He's a backup world champion. Because CM Punk's still the world champion. You know, I don't give a fuck about Phil right now either. But, I'm just saying, you know. Because, uh, because, uh, AEW needs seat fillers. If you're, if you're looking for a job, call AEW. They need some seat fillers. You know, you gotta work from 6 to 11, though. You gotta sit there for five hours and endure their five-hour show. So, if you want a job, AEW's a place for you for seat fillers. Because they need some. They're hiring. Seat fillers. Alright, I just want to throw that out there because that's what they're hiring for. And, um, I saw, and of course it's Game Changer Wrestling, no shock there, garbage championship wrestling is what I call it, as your AEW world champion, or backup world champion, John fucking, I wear a tank top, Kakashka Moxley, with some mustard on it. Mr. Alki. Need a little more boozing, have you? Suck it back on Grandpa's old cough medicine, John? You need to go back to it if you want 50 million Nick Gages to say Vince this as he needs. What the fuck were you doing? Were you smoking Jack that day? Oh! Fucking alcoholic. Jake Jr. Only thing you don't do coke. Or meth. Fucking. I saw. A picture of supposedly the guy that's the AEW World Champion kissing a guy named Iffy or Effy or, or Jabroni, where the fuck his idiot's name is. I don't give a fuck about him either because he's garbage. If you work at Game Changer Wrestling, you're not working very much. Because how much do you make for that? 50 bucks? Well, that, won't co that won't cover Renee Kakashka's uh, podcast bills, will it, John? Huh? I know her podcast is in the shitter. I'm just being honest, she's boring. That's just me. And I can see why she's with your ass. She loves Alki like you do. Um. Fucking. I saw him kissing this goddamn guy. And I'm like, this is a fucking world champion. A fucking world champion. A world champion would never do something so fucking stupid. Like you are. And that's why. And, and then I saw some fucking jamoke. Fucking say, John Moxley's more over than, he's doing way more better than Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins. What the fuck are you smoking, Mark? John Moxley is the worst fucking wrestler I've ever seen in my fucking life. He looks like a trash bagger. He lacks like a trash bagger. He probably smells like a trash bagger with all the booze on him. And he's, and he, and he, and he's a fucking joke to the wrestling business. He's an embarrassment. He was homesick. He, he, WWE did everything for this fucking idiot. And tried to show him the right way to wrestle. But nah, he wants to go back to garbage. He wants to go back to fucking Haynes or Heffy or where the fuck it was. He wants to go fucking play, play, uh, play fucking, play fucking combat zone again. Well, you see, now you're making 50 bucks. Do you feel bad now? Huh? You're, you're, you're sitting at the goddamn table like Jake did sleeping. And eating hot dogs. And drinking a coke. Yeah. You're 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 the next Jake Roberts on Beyond the Mat, John. That's what you are. You work in these indie outlaw mud shows like fucking Jake Roberts did on Beyond the Mat. The only thing difference you're not wearing sweatpants. That's the only difference. If if fucking he is a fucking disease to the wrestling business. Like you're not a fucking top guy. You never were a top guy. You never was going to be a top guy. And to me, you're still not a top guy. All you are is a Onita bootleg fucking red-haired fuck. 
That's all the fuck you are, John Moxley. And by the way, Onita ain't that good either. At least he gets on a biker jacket. What do you wear? Fucking, and at least he smokes and didn't care about the guy who, who committed suicide. Yeah, on Dark Side of the Ring, I remember that. That's true. And fuck it. And then, and then you got this motherfucker. He, he's embarrassing. He's a fucking embarrassment. Like, and fuck it. And people think he's fucking great. Where? I don't see it. I don't see the appeal of John Moxley. I don't see no talent in John Moxley. I, I, I think he's a fucking scrub, if you ask me. And that's why he's a joke as an AEW World Champion. Will always be a fucking joke. That's why I don't give a fuck about him. Don't give a fuck about Effie. Don't give a fuck about Game Changer Garbage Wrestling. Don't give a fuck about any of that garbage. So you know what, John Moxley? Continue making your 50 bucks in hot dogs. And, 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 and help try to pay Renee's fucking podcast bills. And, and fucking enjoy that sweet life of garbage. Because that's where you are. Enjoy the mud shows, John.